I'm just like you. I'm one, you know. Elder millennial. Well, oh, good. <laughs> Get your ear pierced. That's cool, man. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, I'm Jaren. I'm Shama. And this is a game uh, that we're playing called This or That. Pastor or comedian. So we're gonna look at a couple different quotes and um, just decide if we think this is a pastor who has said this or uh, a comic. So we're both stand-up comedians. But I also feel like it's gonna be tough because like pastors want to be comedians, but so comedians bad, don't want to come across as pastors. Pastors want to be comics so bad. Yeah, they try. They're like, this uh, killed at first service. Yeah, but it bombed now. So <laughs> time travel. Say that too. When it bombs, they go, Saturday night, love we that. Are, and you're like, like, oh, okay, sure. did they? Yeah. My dad was a pastor, so I was I was the uh, the setup and punchline of a lot of his jokes. Oh, when that is a lot. bummer, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. You know you're getting old when someone compliments your alligator shoes and you're barefoot. That's got to be a comedian. You know what I'm thinking? And this is like this is like throwback Christian comedian. <laughs> I think this is a Mark Lowry quote. My hairline's moving, but I am standing still. I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna go comedian. This seems like a a comic from the 80s or 90s. Mm. It is pastor. What? <laughs> it's Greg Laurie. <laughs> okay. Shout out to Greg. Is it you opinion? know you're getting old when someone compliments your new alligator shoes and you're barefoot. I That's love that echo. He goes, you know you're getting old. Just because it's the testimony portion of service doesn't necessarily mean you have to talk. Talking about your payless shoes. That ain't a testimony. That's a store policy. That's a pastor if I've ever heard a quote no, from No, I don't think so. That's one of those things where you're like, it's like, it's a, it's like the LaCroix of jokes where you're like, I can taste the funny. <laughs> <laughs> but it's not like, you know, it's not like a Mountain Dew. Yeah. <laughs> it's not like punching oh, me in the some, face. There's some flavor there's there. There's some flavor. There's some, I can, I, oh. I get it. You go, mmm. I straight up think they're trying to throw us off. Okay, I'll say, we'll, we'll go with comedian then. No, I knew that. Yeah, ah, yeah. Steve I didn't want to be like. I didn't want to be like. No, I. That's that's like a. Anyway, okay. Just because. Yeah. Yeah. It's the testimonial portion of service. Don't necessarily mean me. You, you got to talk. talk. <laughs> if you had typed it in, you got to. I was to, at Payless Shoes the other day. And I bought a pair of shoes, and I got them shoes home, and you know, Lord, I just, I just ain't want them shoes no more. And Lord, they give me all my money back. Larry, hallelujah. <laughs> that ain't a testimony. That's a stole policy. <laughs> Steve Harvey is phenomenal. I, I will not watch. If it's Family Feud and it's not Steve Harvey, I'm not in. It's the short Tino family against the Galvin family. It's so imperative that I turn into Steve Harvey as I age. Dude. That's what I've told my wife. I'm like, I know you're marrying, you know, hip homeschool grad now, but I'm hip slowly, slowly. Hip, you saw how you did that? Hip, hip cool, you know, cool, cool guy. Man, I've started the process of morphing into Steve Harvey. In my opinion, Saying smoking hot wife one time, you're proclaiming it because it's true. Three times, you're just trying to convince yourself. <laughs> That's a pastor. So I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go pastor on Gotta this go one. Gotta go pastor on this one. Yeehaw! Kevin Thompson, I don't even, but he. Whenever I read a guy talk about his smoking hot wife, the first time I read it, I think, oh, oh, that's good. That's good for him, <laughs> right? The second time I read it, I'm like, hmm, I don't think he believes it. And the third time I read it, I'm convinced. He's trying to convince himself. You know what this video is missing? It's missing that Greg Laurie echo. <laughs> My old pastor, do you know why? He used to always say, like, smoking hot wife and all that. Do you know why he said that? He used to tell us in staff meeting, he was like, I say that so people in the church, like ladies in the church, know that I love my wife, and so they can't, like, approach me. I'm like, I'm oh, like, no, dang, dude, I don't like, think that that's... I don't know if that's how that works. But, yeah, you know. that's the only thing repelling them. <laughs> I also... Is that joke inspo for, like, your tour name? Yeah, the Smoking Hot Life. <laughs> yeah, Smoking Hot Wife, Smoking Hot Life. Uh, that is the, yeah, we have the Smoking Hot Life tour. Yes. That we're currently doing shows for uh, just different places all over the country, so... Uh, come out and see us. Yeah, come hang. All right, the next one. I think Jesus was probably just a typical 16-year-old know-it-all. Think about it. 
All teenagers think they know it all, but he really did. Oh, dang, that hook at the end lands yeah. it as a pastor. That's a pastor. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, that's a pastor. It was like, something funny, something funny, something a little funny, something serious. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm raising my voice because I'm making a point, and I'm whispering because I want to relate to you. I'm going to lock in on a pastor for that one, I think. Mm. Oh, is it really? No! Oh. <laughs> I think Jesus was probably just a typical 16-year-old know-it-all. <laughs> think about it. All teenagers think they know it all, but he really did? Brian, just so you know, when you see this, uh, there are many pastors who have stolen your line, for sure. <laughs> Essential oils are still witchcraft. You can't just call a cauldron a diffuser and make it holy. What do you think that is? That's a comedian. <laughs> That's a comedian. That's that should be my joke. <laughs> if 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 we click the next slide and it's a different person, I'm gonna flip this table. Yeah, it's yeah! my joke. All right, all right, all right. Here in Myers, check this guy killing. out. It's witchcraft and it's potions. <laughs> I know, right? And now, if I get a headache, that woman comes around the corner like, well, all you need is two drops of peppermint and thieves. The little, the, the walk with the, that is so funny. That it's the cause of the come out. It's creepy when you're this close. When it's like on stage and you're farther away. A cauldron, a diffuser, and make it holy. Do you know any like serious essential oil people? Yeah. You guys familiar with essential oils? Yeah, a couple of you are twitching for your vials right now. Don't you dare. Don't you dare, mustache. I will baptize you in peppermint. Don't say a word. Yeah, 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 yeah. I knew a lady, and I had severe asthma. I have to stress this, severe asthma. And uh, she was like, you just need to do, like, you know, eucalyptus and rub it on your elbow and yada, yada, yada. And I, and I kept trying that for, like, years. And my friend's mom, Miss Rachel, was like, Shama, I can hear you wheezing. You need to go see Dr. Neil K.O. Yeah. Go and I went, and I was like, oh, yeah, I guess. And I told him, I was like, I was using essential oils. He was like, I think some people are sitting at tables that Jesus would have flipped. This is a <clears throat> this is a Judah Smith quote. <clears throat> this is a comedian I keep, quote. I keep saying Judah Smith because I imagine him being like, he can't help himself. You know that, right? No, 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 no that's not. He would be. Uh, this is a pastor. This is a comedian. You think so? I think it's a comedian. Is it you? Is this one of your it one is of your one quotes? Of quotes yeah. Is it really? <laughs> Dude, the fact that's you said Carl, I'm like, whoa. I that's mean, a good... I'll take it. Yeah. I think some people are sitting at tables that Jesus would have Oh, this flipped. is your if youth you pastor video. Then yeah. I'm a foreman. Deconstruction is my that's D word. That's I don't even like saying it. Deconstruction's my D word? <laughs> some of the things that you've put out on the internet, I sweat. Like, when I watch a video, I go, ah, we have a tour together. There's so much on the line. But it's not me, <laughs> like, though. It's go, not me. It's not me. It's that's, the character. That's the, that's that's the dude. That's the character. I've said some, the loose cannon guest speaker has said stuff that I could never repeat. Oh, I, I didn't know. know that was one of your lines. That's Sorry. me, man. That's, that's a good me. line. If you want to keep up with me, guys, it just go to like transformationchurch.com. <laughs> All right, the teacher said, how can I get to heaven? The little boy who was new to Sunday school that week shouted from the back, you have to be dead. You have to be dead. Oh, I know what this was. That's, that's gotta be a pastor. Uh, I don't think so. Maybe, let's go pastor. Let's go pastor. Yeah, 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 I was like, I was like I've seen this clip. Well, the teacher said, then how can I get to heaven? See, he's got that reverb. He's got that. And the little boy who was new to Sunday school that week shouted out the answer from the back, you have to be dead. I love that they cut to the audience. Straight to this guy. That. Oh, dang it, I hit the, the wrong thing. Uh, I love that they cut to the audience to be like, see? See? Wait, don't stop, stop, stop hitting stuff. I got it. <laughs> You're just. For a second. I... <clears throat> it's like you gotta get in your lower register. And the boy in Sunday school, the new heaven, said, You have to be dead. Now, nah, that's funny, but that's the truth. True. But some of y'all are dead right now. And then you're like, oh, he brought it back. You ever been to one of those events where the guy on stage is like, if you died in a car accident on the way home tonight, do you know where you're going? And you're like, ah. I grew up in a Christian household. When we weren't eating, we weren't starving. We were fasting. Is this Dave Ramsey? That's good. Huh? This is a ah, comedian. This is a comedian. That's yeah, a comedian. that's a comedian. Yeah, okay. Because I grew up in a Christian household. He's got a lot of and, uh, when we wasn't eating, we wasn't starving. <laughs> we was fasting. <laughs>
Jay Stevens, man. Oh, that was so good. You heard about the girl? Oh, this is this is a pastor. Just from the from the setup of you heard about the girl who went to a palm reader about her problem of not getting a husband, and he said you'll be proposed to three times this year, and she said no, I won't. I'm going to accept the first one. <laughs> This is a pastor for that's sure. That's a pastor. That's a, just from the setup of you heard about the girl, you know? That's a pastor. Yeah, that's ah, Billy Graham. You that's heard the about guy. the girl that uh, went to the palm reader to went see to the if palm she could reader. find any answer to our problem about not getting a husband. And he said, you'll be proposed to three times this next year. And she said, no, I won't. I'm going to accept the first one. I like, I like the thought. Went to the palm reader. <laughs> A Billy Graham trying that out in the in the green room where he's like, I got a new one. Oh, uh, hey, you heard about you the, heard about the girl. Yeah, 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 yeah. You think you shopping? Uh, I love online church. Isn't that the best? But somehow I'm still late. I don't know how that happens. Comedian. Yeah, the, isn't the isn't that the best? Feels like they're filling that time. That feels yeah, like a cadence. Yeah. It would be a comic. All right, comic. Wanda, yeah, come on, Wanda Sykes. Sykes with the online <laughs> church. All right. Oh, I love online church. Isn't that the best? But somehow I'm still late. I don't know how that happens. <laughs> No, it's the, isn't that the best? Cause that's like, they're trying to keep the cadence and the timing up. All right. Look at him right in his eyes and say, silly devil tricks are for kids. 100% a pastor. This has to be a pastor. Cause this is what, this is definitely a pastor joke. Yeah. Where they go, you look him right in the eyes and you say, you know, you know, when you look Satan, the prince of darkness in the eyes. Yeah. I did that once. <laughs> Jaren. <laughs> Can I guess, uh, it's gotta be an African-American pastor too. But okay. Let's see, let's see. That's what you want to go for? Ah! Oh, Stephen <laughs> Burdick? The African American pastor. And look him right in his eyes and say, Yeah. Silly devil? Oh, oh this year they're like, they're like, oh, Jeez. silly devil. Say the line, oh, Steve! Come on. Say the line, yeah, Steve! Man. You should have no, you you tried this on me before I got back to church this year. Because I'm growing this year. Tricks are for kids. I said tricks. I'll tell you what, I'm cuckoo for Christ. <laughs> I've been Shama. I'm Jaren. Thanks for hanging out with us. If you liked this fun and meaningful video, uh, you can watch more. Yeah, make sure you subscribe to uh, Hope Nation so you can keep seeing some fun stuff. And we'll see you out there on the Spoken Hot Life Tour. They're right there. Try if they click. don't add these videos in post, I'm going to look Try so to weird. Try to click one. <laughs>